Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, hi, hi. Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hey, Osmaro. How how is it going, Mister? Very well. Perfect. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining. How was your day at work? Ah. Uh, very tired very oh man i'm so sorry for you i'm so sorry for you but are you ready for classes mister yeah oh, perfect 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 thank you so much thank you thank you that's great welcome welcome to your class i see also mr brian thank you so much for your confirmation over the chat perfect I see more people, you know, getting online and that's amazing. That's perfect. Mr. Herbert, what about you? Hello, Herbert. Hello, hello. All right, probably not available yet. Ashley, what about you, Miss? How is everything? Good teacher. Hey, welcome. Welcome to your class. How was your day? Everything good for you at work? Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's good to hear. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. I see more people connecting and that's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. What about for you, Michelle? How are you doing today, Miss? Miss Michelle, hello, hello. All right, all right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Perfect, perfect. Let me see on one more person. Ingrid Griselda, what about you? How is everything for you? Hello, good evening, everybody. Mm, everything is okay. My work was super good today and just a little tired from the work, but the traffic, the traffic, <laughs> traffic. <laughs> all right, all right. Thank you so much. How much time do you spend on traffic? Mm, maybe. One hour, one hour, one hour. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, thank you. Thank you so much for that information. I see more people. Miss Emilia, what about you? How are you doing? Hi, good evening. Uh, I'm fine, very good. And you, how are you? I'm doing great, just happy, you know, to be working one more time with you. So that, that makes me happy. Uh, me too. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, people. Welcome for today's class. I appreciate uh, your effort to be here punctually. So let's get started, okay? As usual, we begin by checking in attendance. So you know what to do when you listen to your name. Let's get started. Mr. Alexander Bryan, I know you are listening through the chat. So, All right, thank you so much, Mr. Alexander, for your confirmation. All right, perfect, perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. I know. Thank you, thank you. Then, uh, then I have Miss Ashley Ramos. Present, sure. Thank you, thank you so much. All right. After that, I have Brenda Yvette. Brenda, uh, I guess she told me she was on traffic at this moment, all right? So I understand if there is no response yet, okay? I continue. Brenda Patricia? Brenda Patricia? Okay, not yet. I continue. Carlos Antonio? Uh, here, teacher. Perfect. How are you doing? I find teacher working. 
All right. Thank you so much for the effort, mister. Thank you so much. Okay. I continue, Eduardo Garcia. Good evening. Hey, how are you doing, mister? Um, I, um, um, I am fine. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Thank you so much. That's good to know. What about you, Erika? Erika, hello, hello, Erika. Hello, teacher. Um, hey. <laughs> and they're working now. <laughs> You're working now? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. All right. So sorry for you, but thank you so much for the effort to be online. I move on and I go to Miss Stephanie Patricia. Present, teacher. Thank you. Thank you so much. How was your day, Miss? Very good, teacher. <laughs> Perfect, perfect, good to know, thank you. I have Estrella Dulcinea, I know you are alert over there on the chat. So thank you so much Estrella, thank you, thank you. I move on to Fernando Rafael. Fernando Rafael. All right, probably not yet, I continue, Francisco Castro. Right, Francisco Castro, I move on. Miss Griselda Grande. Good evening. Present. Thank you. Thank you so much, Miss, for your confirmation. I continue. Herbert Danilo. Mr. Herbert, hello, hello. All right, all right. I continue. It is Paola. It is Paola Samayoa. Okay, move on. Carla Elizabeth Valencia. I guess there is a confirmation over the chat, right? Thank you. Thank you so much. And thank you, Fernando, for your confirmation. I have Kenya Patricia. For you. Present. Thank you so much, Miss. Thank you. Kenya Raquel. All right. Thank you so much for the confirmation in the chat. Levi Martinez. All right, thank you. Thank you so much for your confirmation. Lucy Esperanza. Miss Lucy Esperanza. All right, I move on. Michelle Alejandra. Michelle Alejandra, hello, hello. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I continue. Nelson Omar. Nelson Omar. Okay, I move on. Uh, Norma Margarita. All right, thank you so much for your confirmation. Osmaro Aníbal. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, Paula Julisa. Hello, teacher. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Miss Paula. Rafael Eduardo. Present. All right, all right, thank you. Then Rosa Emilia. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much, everybody, for your confirmation on this. Perfect, perfect. All right, let's get into business for today. Right. For today's class. Okay, all right, perfect. People, we are working on today's session, and today we have what class number? 15. 15. 15. Oh, amazing. <laughs> How many classes are we missing to finish the class, to finish this beginner number two? Five. 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 Five, Five classes. Right. Correct, right? Correct. Five classes and we finish beginner number two. So let's keep working on that one, people. Let's continue, you know, connecting and actively participating. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's do something quick, right? Something quick from yesterday. All right. Let me choose on some people. All right. Let me see who will participate at this moment and for that 
let me choose on Carlos Antonio. I need your help, Carlos Antonio. What do you remember about yesterday's class? I remember teacher. Uh, hmm. We we use a uh, who uh huh who where where uh huh why uh huh and uh, which uh huh which correct uh -huh. Uh -huh. And who uh, when? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, um, and only did <laughs> on my mind uh, is. But that's amazing. That is good information, Carlos good information people how do we call those words we have who when why how do we call them wh wh words right because that small element is a wh word Right, the complete info that is a WH question, right? But complete element, but at this moment, WH words. All right, people tell me if I want to know information about a place, what is the WH word? Where, where, okay. If I want information about time, when, when. when. Information or, or reference about one person. Where? Who? 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 Perfect. Who? Yes, that's correct. You talk about who. And if I want to know the reason for something, what's the Why? WH word? Why? 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 <clears throat> perfect, perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. That's correct. Well done, people. Well done. Good review. Well done. Uh, let's do something quick, just to remember also on present continuous. There is a book practice on page 36 on your books. If you have your books, open them and go for that exercise. Let's see on this one, something easy, just to remember how to use this. Let me see. Let me get my tools here. But I know you're experts, all right? I know you are experts for this information. Okay, check on this one. We have some instructions for completing this exercise. And as always, I need your help. What are the instructions, people? It says fill. Using the, words, using the word in parentheses. All right. Hey, thank you. Thank you so much. So that's what we do at this moment. We complete with the information we have in this one. Take a look at the first example. We have some elements here. All right. We have some elements and we make the correct word order, and we make the transformation or combination for present continuous. All right, let's read together the example. Number one, everybody, what company? What mm -hmm. company? What company are you working for? What company for? are you working for? Exactly, what company are you working for? And in that case, how do you respond to that one? What is a possible response? Uh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Papi, I got some food on the table. How, how do you answer to that one? Imagine a person is asking you, hey, I work what company are you working on? Mm -hmm. I'm how working on. Yes. I am working in... Yeah, exactly. I'm working. Let me see. Okay. Let me 
make my, my this information a little smaller. There you are. I'm working uh, in, or you can say at. Remember, these two prepositions are valid. I'm working in, or I am working at, and then you say the name of the company. All right. Now, let's do a quick practice on this one. Hey, Paula Julissa, what company are you working for? I'm working in Supertext El Salvador. All right, Supertext. Is that uh, is that in Chalchuapa? Yes, teacher. Ah, all right, all right. I know. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> what about you? Let me see, Mr. Rafael. Hey, Rafael, what company are you working for? I am working in uh, Grupo Bimbo. Oh, in Bimbo. All right, thank yes. you. Thank you so much. Let me just uh, copy one, the answer for this one. Because of the preposition, let's see, I'm working for, just to continue with the same element from the question. It is possible to say, I am working in, I am working at, that is valid, no problem, all right? No problem for that. But before of this one, let me see. For this information, for, you have to use the same information here, all right? The same preposition. I'm working for Bimbo, right? I'm working for, and then you give the details. Let me see. Uh, Carlos Antonio, what company are you working for? I'm working for Yves Teacher. Oh, all right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Carlos Antonio. The same question to other classmates, please, to continue with the practice. Uh, Carla, Yulisa. Carla, Carla, what, Carla. What, what, uh, what company you working? Mm -mm. What company are you working for? Are you working? For? Are you working? Sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, what's the name of the person, please? E Erika? Oh, all right. Thank you. Erika, what company are you working? Are you working for? Remember the last I element. Working, working for. for it's Express. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Erika. Choose other classmate, Erika, and continue with the practice. Okay. Um, it's there. Yeah? I guess she's not available at this moment. She's having problems at this moment with the audio, so she cannot connect. All right, choose other person. Um, um, you can have Ashley, Osmara. you can have ah, Osmaro's way. All right, thank you. Okay, I am working uh, for IT, IT Consulting. Oh, amazing, amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Perfect, people. That's okay for this question number one. Thank you so much. Now, check on this one, guys. After this one, we complete the next exercises for present continuous. What about number two, people? How do we complete number two? How is he dividing? Thank you, Rafael. Thank you, Rafael. Thank you. Thank you so much. What about the rest of people? What's your alternative? How do we complete? How is he dividing the group? Thank you, Smaro. Thank you, Smaro. Good, good, good. I have representation for the boys. What about the ladies? Hmm. What is your version for number two, Stephanie? How is he divide group? All right, thank you. Check on this one. So you have this alternative. Remember, we continue using present continuous. How? How is he dividing, dividing the groups? Perfect, people. Nice done. If you completed this on your books, check, right? Check 
your work and check the information on the screen, right? What about number three? What's the correct question? When? When is she when handing the checks? When is she handing when the checks? When is she handing the check? Handing. Exactly. Thank you so much. When is she handing the checks? That's correct. <clears throat> See on this one, people. Handing is similar to say giving. All right, it's kind of similar to say handing, giving. When is she giving the checks? When is she handing the checks? Similar idea, all right? Similar idea, perfect. Number four, people, how do we complete? Which factory is your bus visiting this month? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, people. Good alternatives. I appreciate that. Thank you. Check on this one. You got it correct. All right. Which factory is your bus visiting this month? All right. Thank you. Nicely done, people. And what about number five? How do we complete? Why is the new secretary? Why is the new secretary working the next Saturday? Yes. Ah, all right, all right. Thank you so much. That's correct. Everyone, check on this one. Why is the new secretary working the next Saturday? Perfect, perfect, perfect. And after that, we have all correct questions for these exercises. Any question about this? Any comment so far? No, okay. Thank you, thank you for the feedback. Thank you, thank you. What about the rest? What do you say? Is there any question about this? Number five. Let's see. Why is this new secretary working? Mm -hmm. In this case, the person is making reference. All right. The person is making reference to an action for a future plan. All right. In this case, the secretary is working, that is a plan, that is something that is going to happen next Saturday. But the question is to discover the reason why. Probably it is not, it is not normal for the secretary to work on Saturday, but this week is different. And that is like an obligation for her. And that's probably the reason why the person is saying this one. Why is the secretary working next Saturday, right? That is something that was already arranged. Es algo que ya estaba eh, quizás acordado de cierta forma, que el jefe lo designó de cierta forma, como, hey, the secretary, you're working next Saturday. Right? Como, quizás no es común o no es parte de su horario, y se lo asignaron, hey, vas a trabajar, ¿ok? Vas a trabajar el sábado. Y la persona eso está preguntando, ¿Por qué va a trabajar la secretaria el otro sábado? Why? Why is she working? Right? That is the emphasis of that one. Asking for a future plan, right? To, to, to get some explanations for something. Mm -hmm. Is it a little bit clearer now, Rafael? Any more questions, mister? Hello. 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 All right. Hello. Perfect. Hello. Perfect. Perfect. And thank you so much for your confirmation. All right. Now, people, let's continue working on some more information for these topics. Give me a second so I can erase all my drops. All right, let's see. 
This is something that we did yesterday. If you remember, we were thinking about, what were we thinking about in the last part? Thinking about what? A future plan. Future plan. Exactly. Do you remember my future plan? Play video games. Play video games. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect. That's Play correct. And that, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Playing free fire. Yes. We make a squad squads, right? We, we play in groups, right? Más tarde vamos a jugar en, en, en escuadra todos. Uh -huh. All right, check in on this one, right? Um, hey, yes, with, with Emilia. Yes, why not, right? <laughs> so you have this one as an idea, right? I am playing video games. And do you remember the next part for this practice? This is the idea. I am playing when. video games. Do you remember the, the other part of the practice? Uh -huh. What were we doing? When do you play? What? Ah, uh -huh. what? What? What is the game uh, are you playing? Ah, exactly, exactly. What other beginnings do you remember? Um, WH words, WH words. When, when, why? When, why? Exactly. Perfect, perfect. The first idea. Give me a second. All right, I just put on mute everybody. All right, the first idea is to express a general plan with no reference, right? I am playing video games. That is a future plan. But the next exercise is to ask for information, all right? To ask for information about that future plan. And for that, we can use uh, WH words in combination of the simple or the present continuous, right? What game are you playing? Where are you playing? Who are you playing with? Why are you playing video games? When are you playing video games? That was the practice from yesterday. All right. Let's do one more practice as a class. Let me see. I will ask on one volunteer. Miss hmm. Ingrid, I need your help. I <laughs> Because I love that you are always happy for this one. So it's like, yay, let's participate. Thank you so much. Tell the class one future plan. Let's do it one more time, people. One more time. And then we have the speaking practice. But I want to make sure you understand the practice. Tell us, Ingrid, one plan for the future for you. I am, um, ¿cómo se dice? Querer ser chonguitas. Por ejemplo, es algo que se me acaba de venir a la cabeza. All right. You can say, I am making, uh, if I am not mistaken, let me see. Let me give, give me a second because I know the word, but let me, let me check. I remember it's bow if I am not mistaken. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, it's possible. It's possible. But <laughs> let me see. There is. There is a word. I remember. Wow. Hmm. Bow? I remember Bow there is a like word like bow or something like that. Right? Let me see. No, it's not a tie. All right, let's see. Let let me give a general idea, right? The it's kind of like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know the word? Let's see. Oh, let's see. Bow tie. 
All right, let, let me look for that word because I believe there is one. I don't remember if that is bow. All right. <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm making cookies. <laughs> All right, cookies. All right, no problem. But I will but I will look for that one because I remember there is one expression. It's on the tip of my tongue, right? On the tip of my tongue. Como dicen, la punta de la lengua. Because I have it, right? But let's continue with this idea so far. All right. This is, uh, let's see, this is Ingrid's idea for a future plan. All right. I am making cookies. Let me make it a little bigger. All right, thank you. I am making cookies. That is her plan so far. Now, people, let's create questions for Ingrid, and I need your help, please. What is what can we ask for the first one? What kind? Uh huh. What kind? Are you making cookies? What, what, no, kind? what kind of cookies are you making? Uh huh. Thank you. What are cookies? Mm -hmm. Check on this one. What kind? Similar to say what type? Chocolate, vanilla. All right. So in that case, we have a good question. What kind of cookies are you making? People, let's ask. Let's ask Ingrid. Right. Let's read the question. What kind of cookies are you making? Three. Two, one, let's read. What kind, what kind of cookies? What kind are you cookies are you making? Thank you. And tell us, Miss Ingrid, what kind of cookies? I like cookies. For for example, I'm practicing to do to make uh, cookies. Uh, Christmas cookies. Christmas cookies. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let me continue with more with one more question. People, what about for where? Let's work together with a question for where. Mm -hmm. Where do you make where? Um, All right, where are you making the cookies? Oh, thank you so much. Where? Where are you making the cookies? Let's ask Ingrid, please, everybody. Three, two, one. Where, where, where are, you are you making the cookies? Oh, Ingrid. I am making the cookies. I am making the cookies here in my house because I have all the things here. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect. That's the way to it. Yes. <laughs> Make the cookies and invite us. <laughs> Thank you. Who are the cookies? Uh -huh. Thank you. Who are the ones making the cookies? Right. With. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Thank you. Who are you making the cookies with? Everybody ready? Set, go. Who are you making the cookies? Thank you so much. Ingrid, what's the answer for that? Um, with my mom. She's the oh. one who teach me to make this first thing. <laughs> so she's the she is your teacher. Sí, sí, sí. Yes. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. People, I need your help. A question for why? Why? Perfect, perfect. Everybody, let's read together. Ready, set, go. Why? Where Where are are the 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 what about this, Ingrid? Because I like to make desserts, but <laughs> it's gracious, but I don't like sweet things. 
<laughs> you like to make them, but not to eat them. All right, thank you. Thank you so much. And the last question, people, what can we ask? All right, let me. This one. All right, people, the last question is great. So let's read together. Three, two, one. Where are making the cookies? Mm -hmm. Where, right? Uh, when, sorry, when are you making the cookies? Talking about date. Mm -hmm. Let me see. There is one. All right. Now, now, I guess there is one situation. All right. Now, everybody, let's read the question, please. When? When are making the cookies? Uh huh. Ingrid. Um, I'm making the cookies um the weekend because they take work and time. Ooh, all right, all right. Thank you. Thank you so much. How much time do they take? Maybe three hours. Lo que pasa es que hablo mucho, entonces ahí se me va el tiempo. All right. All right. So the process is short, but you know, it's good, right? You enjoy the process. <laughs> All right. No problem. Thank you so much. Okay. Now, people, this is what we do. All right. We work in groups at this moment, and one person expresses a plan, a future plan, and the rest of the class of the rest of the groups is responsible to ask questions, right? Take this as a model, right? The person probably, I am I am visiting my parents. Why are you visiting your parents? When are you visiting your parents? Why, who, right? So you ask questions to discover specific information about future plans. Are you ready for practice? Yes, teacher. Yes, sir. Yes. No, but what about those feelings? Come on, people. It's not Monday today. Today is not Monday. It's almost the end of the week. Are you ready for practice? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. All right. That's better. That's better. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right. Let me create the groups, okay? So we can have the chance to participate with different people. Let me see. Let me make some changes at this moment. Let's see. Give me a second so I create the groups. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Let me make a final change. All right, people, now we begin. Remember, you express a plan. The rest, you ask questions about the plan. We will have for this one 15 minutes, okay? 15 minutes to have a good conversation about this plan, all right? Discover as much information as possible. People, we begin. Thank you so much.
Okay, okay. Thank you so much, everybody, for the time in the practice. Tell me, how did it go? Everything good in the practice? So, so bad? How was okay, the practice? Good. good. All right. Yeah. All right. Wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. What about the rest of you? How was the practice? Everything okay? Okay, okay. Excellent teacher. Perfect. That's good to you know. I was happy to listen to you, you know, talking about plants and also giving details about that. Now let's do something just to have a final group practice. For the practice at this moment, we say something like this, all right? Uh, we give a report. And at this moment, we say the name of the person. For example, I say Luis. Let's imagine I was working with Luis. Luis is, you know, eating pupusas uh, tomorrow. All right. Luis is eating pupusas because it is, uh, because they are his favorite food. Okay, something quick, like something like this. We give at this moment just ideas, all right? And we report. Check on this one. I am not going to mention then the question, all right? At this moment, it is not necessary to mention the question, but in your answer, everything is implied, all right? We understand, right? For example, if I say, Luis is eating pupusas tomorrow, I am giving a reference of time, all right? Luis is eating pupusas because they are his favorite food, that is to give an explanation, all right? It is, there is no necessity to repeat the question, just to say the answer, just to give the details, all right? Vea que ahora que trabajamos ya en el mini reporte para hablar de, de, de lo que descubrimos de los compañeros, ya no es necesario decir, ¿verdad? Como en español, yo le pregunté esto a la persona y él me dijo esto. Eh, eh, just say the report, all right? Just, you, you just go for the report. Vea que en mis oraciones ya se sobreentiende. Si digo tomorrow, es muy probable que yo le pregunte que cuándo, when. All right? No digo la pregunta, pero cuando se los comento a ustedes, ya se sobreentiende. En la segunda one, because they are his favorite food. All right? Yo estoy dando una explicación. Entonces se sobreentiende que antes yo le pregunté a él que por qué va a comer pupusas. ¿Ok? Vea que ya no es necesario hacer mención de la pregunta solo el reporte. Now, let's participate to share some details about something you discovered, all right? And let me ask con Osmaro. Osmaro, can you please share one detail from your classmates, please? Only one, one sentence. Oh, wow. Uh, report? Yeah, one report, only one sentence in the report. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Ashley. Uh -huh. Ashley, uh... Is visiting her family on Hikilisco mm -hmm. uh, with your, her brother uh -huh. uh, because for the Christmas holiday uh, she has she's traveling on mm -hmm. December 24th. Oh, thank you, thank you, Smaro. That is a very complete and good report. Thank you, thank you. What about for you, Nelson? Can you share one report? Only one sentence is okay if you want about your classmates. Okay, teacher. I remember that Rosa Emilia, she is she is going to the beach. She's she's going on on the next month. Mm -hmm. And she said that she is she she is going with her family and bus. Um, and I'm, I'm only that. <laughs> oh, thank you. That's very complete. Very complete. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let me see. Paola, Julissa, can you share something you remember about your classmates' plans, please? 
Okay, este, Nelson Omar. She is going to the beach on Saturday 26. And he is going to the San Blas beach. Just only. Okay, hey, that's fine. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Teacher, I remember one, one thing more. Mm -hmm. Rosemilia said that she going she going to the to the Las Hojas Beach. Oh, all right. Yeah. Very exclusive, my goodness, <laughs> Miss Emilia. Wow. Can you take the complete class with you, please? And the teacher, please. Is that okay, Emilia? Probably no. Probably the answer is no. <laughs> All right. Thank you. But thank you so much for the details. All right. Yes. 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 <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. One, uh, I will give it a chance for two people to volunteer and express ideas that you remember about the plans of your classmates. Two volunteers for this practice. Me. Go ahead, go ahead, tell, me, tell us. Stephanie is dancing because she loves, feels the music in her body. <laughs> oh, amazing, all right. <laughs> for curiosity, what type of music is she dancing? Uh, dancing bachata, salsa, reggaeton, perreo, cumbia. Oh my goodness! Chaka, 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 chaka. <laughs> Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny. <laughs> Hasta abajo. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, that's cute. That's cute. Thank you so much for that report. And Stephanie, you are red at this moment, Stephanie. You're blushing, you know, the meaning of that one. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. He's in this one. Let me see. That is the verb. Let, let me copy this one to you just for vocabulary, right? That is the verb blush, right? The verb blush, it's like to be red in your face right <laughs> like this one right that is the verb blush blush like to be red right in your face wow. so at this moment she let's see she is blushing right she's blushing sonrojarse right Sonrojar. she's yeah <laughs> she's blushing right she, my goodness right <laughs> Sorry, Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. No, but that's okay. That's okay. Yeah. Dancing is nice. Dancing is nice. Now, one more person to share ideas about the plan for your classmates. One more volunteer. Don't be shy. One more person. Please. Thank you, Carlos, Carlos Antonio. Right. And Ingrid was like, no, oh, the teacher is going to say my name. No. Carlos, tell me, or tell the class. Sorry, tell the class. Check on the microphone, please. Mike, Mike, microphone. Thank you. Uh, report is the Nelson teacher. Oh, go ahead. Perfect. He go to the beach. He go uh, or he is going to the beach? He? He's going. He's uh -huh. going to the beach. Ah, thank you. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, next week. All right. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, Who's uh, his family? With his with, family? Yeah. Or with your family? With. 
with mm -hmm. with you, your family, his family. Ah, thank you. you. Hmm. With your family. Check on this one. Check on this one. With your family or with his family. His no. With his family. That's correct. The family of Nelson, right? His family. That should be the best mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Okay. And um, it his family. Why is he uh, he take uh, a moment relax? All right, right. We can say like this one, like this one. He, he is he is relaxing. He is relaxing. He is, yeah, he is relaxing. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the last one. <coughs> Check on this one, Carlos. Give us some details. If you don't remember, make it up, right? Si no se acuerda o no lo dijo, invéntensela. Please. All right. All right. He eating fish. He eating fish. Oh. <laughs> oh. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> I, Why not? I take... All right, thank you so much. And Carlos, what is Nelson drinking? He he drinking, uh, drinking? only <laughs> beer, oh, oh, only water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, or only only water, or what? No, or water, water, oh, water, oh, water. Oh, water. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay, no problem. Only one. Don't lie, a cold December the fourth. Only... Only, 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 chaparro, only, only a big chaparro. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Suda, something like that, my goodness. All um, right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for the details. Good job, Carlos Antonio. Good thank job. You, All right. Thank you. Amazing. Thank you so much, people. Great, great, great. You see, you are doing great on this one. Congratulations, everybody. Good job. Good thank job. You. Now, Let's continue with more practice, you know, to socialize more information. Today, we always have an objective for the class. And let's read together, please. I will. I will be able, able to use, able to use questions, questions continuous for temporary questions at the workplace. Work Perfect. 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 Hey, nicely done. We continue talking about the, the present continuous, you know. Present continuous for actions in the moment, present continuous for future plans, and today, present continuous for temporary situations, all right? Something that is temporary, all right? Let's see on this one. Let's have some questions. Let's see. And let's read, everybody, let's read together on this one. Three, two, one. What? What activities are you going to do at your workplace for this Christmas season? For this Christmas season. Ah, all right. Probably, you know, the activities change because at the end of the year, sometimes we do something special. For example, for me, I am preparing a Christmas show for the students. I am preparing a Christmas show, all right? That is something that for this occasion, it's something that we are preparing, right? But what about you? Let me have some people. Miss Ashley, <clears throat> what are you doing at work for this Christmas season? ¿Cómo sería usar gorro, sombrero, gorro? Oh, all right. Let me see in this one. Let, let me help you. You can say we, right? We are like this. 
one. We're wearing. Estamos usando. We're, o vamos a usar. We're wearing. Vamos a usar. Sería. Where are we ready? Uh -huh. uh -huh. Christmas. Thank you. Christmas hat. Uh, sorry. <laughs> it's possible, right? If if you talk about something more specific, it's possible, right? Christmas hats. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let me see more people. What about on you, Osmaro? What are you doing for this Christmas season at work? I am deco decorating the <clears throat> my workplace. Ooh. Um celebrate with my co-worker <clears throat> in the lunch. All right. Thank you. That's good. Thank you so much. What about you, Herbert? What activities are you doing at your workplace for Christmas season? Uh, uh, different activities mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, with uh, party, party of the year. Uh huh. Uh, no more. <laughs> Only, only, only party. No All more. right. Christmas, the Christmas party. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. What about for you? Let me see more people. Mr. Francisco, what about you, Francisco? What activities are you doing at your workplace? Francisco, hello, hello. Check in the chat. Thank you, Raquel. We are going to decorate with recycling. Hey, that's a good one, Raquel. Thank you. Let me copy that one. All right. Let me choose some more people to participate then. What about for you? Let me see. Miss. Miss, 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 Miss Kenya Patricia, what about you? Hello, hello. Hello, hello, Miss Kenya. All right, thank you so much, Kenya, that's great. Thank you so much, you can answer in the chat. All right, what about for you, Miss Estrella? Hello, ready for practice? Hello, I'm ready. Excellent, thank you so much. I appreciate the effort, Miss. Tell me, Miss Estrella, what activities are you doing at your workplace for this Christmas season? Um, what, mm, in my workplace, mm -hmm. don't celebrate. Uh, Christmas, but mm -hmm. but me, I like Christmas. Mm -hmm. Um, I have a uh, uh, what's it say? Decorate my desk. Uh huh. Uh -huh. I Ooh. like decorate my my desk. All right, all right. So, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. All right. What about the rest of you? Are you doing something special for Christmas? I mean, something different at work? Uh, how do you say participar in un concurso de decoración navideña? Oh, you can say we are. All right. Let me see. You can say literally you say uh, I am participating in a decoration contest. Right? I am participating in a decoration uh, contest. So that is what you are doing at this moment, uh, or, or that is a, a new activity for you, Yvette? No, it's, uh, it's for segunda vez. Ooh. All right, thank you. All right, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. What about the rest? Are you doing something 
new or something different for Christmas at work? Hmm, let's think about it. Yes. Uh, what are you doing? Tell me. Or tell the class, please. Uh, we are playing Secret Friends and oh. we share a dinner with all co workers. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Like Secret, secret Friends. I guess, right? I guess there is a translation for that one. I, I, I am not sure, but secret, secret Santa, right? That's what I have heard. Creo que en inglés le dicen Secret Santa. Creo. Lo he escuchado. Right? Pues nosotros en español es amigo secreto. Yes. But secret in English, I guess. Right? Yo creo que en inglés le dicen Secret Santa, if I am not mistaken. But that's what I think. Right? <laughs> well, but that's cute. That's cute. And what about the, the, the gift from Dollar City? <laughs> no. Or from Simán. No. $20. $20. Ah, that's cute. All right. Hey, that's fine. Thank you. More. All right. The minimum is $20. Yes. Miss Emilia, you work in a good place. Your boss, <laughs> your, I remember, your boss takes you to the beach or to something. I remember you mentioned that one in the group. Yes. You see, you have a secret Santa, $20. Come on, that's nice. <laughs> Congrats. <laughs> All right, perfect, perfect. Thank you so one much, time Alexander. In the uh -huh. year. Yeah, like one time is good, right? Not every day, but one yes. time a year. Eh, why not, right? Why mm -hmm. not? Thank you so much, Brian, for your sentence. I am attending the Christmas dinner, right? Thank you so much. Nicely done, people. Nicely done. Now, let's continue with more practice. Let me see. All right. Let's work together on this one. Just let me raise this. One. All right. There we are. Perfect. There is a short conversation on page 37. As you can see, there are some elements that are covered in this one. Take a look at this one. What do these days? We transform the information, all right? We transform the information. Like this one. Check on this. What are you doing these days? Using the present continuous, all right? So in this, all of this, we use the present continuous, all right? So we make a transformation for present continuous. But at this moment, let's work together. We begin reading and we begin checking on this information, all right? We start here on this part and we continue reading all the conversation, all of you together. Let's read together. Are you ready for practicing, people? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes, yes teacher. Thank you. Yeah. Let, let's begin. Thank you so much. Ready, set, go. Everybody. Hi, Beth. Hi, Hi Beth. 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 Long, Long time. time. Long time. How are you? How are, How are you? you? Hello, Eva. Hello, Ever. Hello, Ever. What are you doing? How are you doing this day? Hey. I am How about you? Continue. That sounds great. That sounds great. What a coincidence. What a coincidence. Also taking I know. 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 I I am 
Thank you. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see at this moment. All right, let me just check on some information for pronunciation. Let me see on this one. This one, this one. This, this, um, this as well. Mm, 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 mm. I guess that is everything. Oh, this one as well. Okay, check on pronunciation, right? Check on pronunciation. Hear me. Coincidence. 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 Right. One more time. Coincidence. 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 Let's read the complete expression, right? Complete expression. Listen, what a coincidence. What a coincidence. What a coincidence. What a coincidence. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Perfect. What a coincidence. All right. What a coincidence, right? They have the same. That, that is the idea, right? What a coincidence. Next one, listen and repeat. Essential. 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 Perfect. The Essential. next one, completed. 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 There you are. There you are. The next one. Course. 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 Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, well done. Well done. The next one. Studying. 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 All right. All right. The next one. Listen. Results. Result. 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 Perfect. Thank you. Incorrect results. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. Results. Uh -uh. Listen. Results. 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 There you are. And the last one. Doing. 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 Right. Thank you. Thank you so yeah. much. Now. Is there a question for vocabulary on this one? Teacher, college, yeah. college, uh, Oh, right. Hey, this one. College. college. All right. In this one is colleague. 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 Aha. Yes, 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 yes. Let me see. Uh, for example, Let's see on this one. Let me switch on the, the, the color, right? I am a teacher and, all, and I have a friend and my friend is a teacher. So we are colleagues. Wow. We, have the same, we have the same profession, all right? Colega. You are a doctor. Another person is a doctor you are colleagues. You have the same profession, right? That is what you say. Colleague. Check on the difference on this one. Let me see. This is where you study. College. College. That is where you study. College. But colleague is different, right? Colleague is the person that has the same profession as you. Right? College, colleague. College, colleague. And in this case, we're talking about a person, colleague. Mm -hmm. Colleague. Mm -hmm. Colleague. Perfect. Yes. Colleague. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Any other question about vocabulary for this? Vocabulary, pronunciation. All right, no problem. Thank you so much. Let's continue working with more information for this. 
as you may see in this part, they are using the present continuous, all right? Present continuous. But what is the emphasis for this information? Read on this info, temporary? Situation. Perfect. Temporary situations. Let me show you something. Yes. Okay. I need your help to watch on this video. In this video, we have some examples for this uh, information, all right? Let's watch, and then we have explanation. I put everybody on mute, and let's listen. TV. The present continuous. When do we use the present continuous? 1. To describe something happening right now. The teacher is trying to teach the class. Andy is driving to work. Helen and Kate are talking. She was like, oh my god, I know, it's like, so hilarious. Two. Something we think to be temporary. John is working from the London office for six months. Six months is a temporary period of time. Lewis and Juliet are living abroad for the summer. The summer is another temporary period of time. Craig is saving money to buy a new house. Greg is saving money for a temporary period of time. All right, all right. Thank you so much. Now, people, do you remember the examples on the video? What examples do you remember? Andy is driving to work. Uh huh. Andy is driving to work. And was that a temporary action or was an action in progress in the video? Progress. An action in progress. In progress, right? The person was driving. Other example that you remember? Teacher is trying to, <laughs> to teach the class. <laughs> Price, saving money to new house. All right, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Two examples. The first one, the teacher is trying to explain the class. Is that action in progress? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right, yes. thank you. The other one, uh, the person, I don't remember if it was Craig or something, is saving money to buy a house. Is the action in progress or is an action that is temporary? It's temporary. temporary. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Good memory, people. Good memory. Let me explain this to you. On the book, we have some information about this one. And then we have a reference about this. All right. Let's have and let's read together. Oh, let me see. I have one volunteer at this moment. I don't usually give the chance for volunteers. But at this moment, I need one volunteer to read all this info information, all right? All of this information. Any person to read this one? Me. All right, go ahead, go ahead, thank you. Use the present continuum for temporary situation. The expression these days and at 
the moment mm -hmm. are often used to em emphasize the temporary aspect of the activity. All right, thank you so much. Thank you so much. There are some expressions, as, as Miss Media mentioned, that give reference or emphasize the temporary aspect of an activity. Check on the different examples we have on the book, right? On the book, we have some examples. Let me see. And there is a time expression. Boys, I need your help. Boys, can you read example number one, please? Boys, ready, set, go. Boys, I am. I am ready. I am reading. I am oh, book. This day. <laughs> all right. Thank you so much. The person is expressing an idea. All right. I am reading a book these days. And ladies, can we read the explanation here in red, please? This is all right, thank you. So this check on this one. The person is reading a book, right? Not at this moment, but the person is starting the action and probably in one week, in two days, in one month, the person will finish. For that reason, we say this one is a temporary action. All right? Tell me, are you reading a book these days? What about you? Personal question. Are you reading a book these days? No. 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 Oh, all right. That's good. That's good. You know? All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But this is something that at the end we'll finish. All right? We we finish. Boys, example number two, please. Wendy. Wendy is having a meeting at this moment. Ah, all right. Uh, just Thank you so much, boys. Thank you so much. Ladies, let's read the explanation. The meeting. The, the meeting will be sooner or later. Sooner. Exactly. Sooner or later, right? In a short time or in a bigger time. Sooner, later. For example, similar to the class, all right? Hey, I am having English class, all right? It will finish at 10 and also talking about the final day it's going to finish sometime for that reason these expressions can uh, give like a reference about a temporary okay. action right the last one last example boys please we we are taking we are an taking an English course, course. ah exactly and ladies what is the reference in parentheses the course. The course. Yeah. Exactly. This course is not forever. The beginner too is not forever. So <laughs> you say, hey, we are taking English class, right? Or we are taking classes in the beginner too. Oh, that's good. Because you make reference that it is something temporary, not forever, and not necessarily in the moment. Se puede decir esta expresión tipo a las 7 de la mañana. Hey, I am taking English classes, right? I am taking the beginner number two. And, and that is not for something uh, at the moment, right? Ve que ahí no está haciendo referencia a algo en el momento, porque usted no va a estar en clase a las 7 de la mañana, pero está haciendo énfasis que está tomando clases en un curso que obviamente va a tener su finalización, algo temporal, right? So that is a little bit of the, the reference. Let me give you more examples. Les tengo más para que lo veamos por acá. There are some elements to consider. Check on the first element. Let's build a timetable. Vamos a hacer una línea de tiempo para comprender un poco más. What is the first element on a screen? Past. Past. The past, past. All right? And past. when we talk about the past, we say, what is the past? ¿Quién me puede dar una referencia de expresión de tiempo del pasado?
tomorrow is not for the past. Yesterday. Right now? Yesterday. Uh, yesterday. Yes. What is other? Yesterday. Last mm. week. Last week? Any other? Monday. <laughs> on Monday? Yeah, because it's on the past, right? For this week. Yeah, perfect. Right. We have a timetable, right? To consider the past. What is the other element that we have on this screen? Future. 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 Exactly, exactly. We have the past, we have the future, and between the past and the future, there is one present. element. Present. Present. Perfect. The present, or we say now. All right, thank you. Present. All right, check on these exercises. These examples. Can you read together, please? I, I, am, I am learning, learning English. English. I learning English. The next one, second example. I, I am supervising. I am supervising the inventory. Supervising the inventory. The last one. I am interviewing I am people for a new position. Okay, perfect, perfect. In this case, we can make reference to something that is temporary. And we consider this one. Something started in the past, goes now, continues to the future. But it will finish, right? It will finish. I am learning English, right? Since beginner one, si tomamos de referencia que estoy aprendiendo inglés desde cuándo? Probably last, last month or two months ago. Tal vez hace dos meses. Uh, I am learning English. You started today. You are doing the action, but probably <coughs> later you are going to finish. All right? Vean la referencia que nos está dando. No es relevante cuando inició. Yo se lo puse en la timetable para que usted comprenda un poco mejor la idea. Right? Inició en el pasado, hace dos meses. Mentalícese del curso. Think about the English course. Today you continue. Now, usted todavía continúa en el curso. O sea, todavía está aprendiendo. But in the future, probablemente en el futuro, usted va a finalizar porque ya va a poder. Entonces, es una acción temporal. It can be for one week, two weeks, one month, two years. No es relevante cuánto tiempo nos va a tomar, pero es una acción que eventualmente va a finalizar. That is the emphasis. Similar to the other example from the book. I am reading a book. Estoy leyendo un libro. ¿Es ¿Qué estás haciendo? Ah, estoy leyendo un libro. Fíjate. Ah, chill. What, what, what book are you reading? Ah, I am reading this book. All right. But eventually you will finish. Eventualmente usted va a finalizar ese libro y esa acción va a finalizar. That is the emphasis for this one. The present continues for temporary actions. Similar to this one, number two. I am supervising the inventory. But in two days, I finish and that's it, right? Tal vez en dos días yo me acabo el inventario de la empresa y ya lo terminé. Pero si a mí me preguntan, ¿es qué estás haciendo en estos días? Uh, I am, I am uh, supervising the inventory, right? And then... You finish on, on this. Something that probably is a very common expression is like to say something like this. Right. This expression is very common. These days. Generalmente le acompañamos con esta expresión. These days, como estos días. Hace referencia un tanto a algo temporal, ¿verdad? Como, ¿qué? ¿Qué estás haciendo estos días? Ah, I am doing exercise, probably, all right? Uh, I, am watching, I am watching a series, ¿verdad? Tal vez ya me estoy echando una serie, ¿verdad? Y usted dice, hey, fíjate que estoy viendo una serie. Ay, ¿cuál está viendo? Ya se pone uno a hablar. Cuando se termine la serie, usted ya, pum, pum, se acabó la serie, ya no la va a ver, generalmente, ¿ok? Entonces, para hablar para algo que sea temporal. I am watching uh, la re I am watching La Reina del Sur. Ah, that's a, that's a good one, right? Uh -huh. And then you begin talking. Something that is temporary, right? No es relevante cuando inició, 
no es relevante cuándo va a finalizar, pero sí el, la idea, ¿verdad? Que hace tiempo lo viene haciendo, todavía lo continúa y, y tal vez va a seguir al futuro, no sabemos cuándo, pero va a finalizar. No es el énfasis cuándo inició, no cuándo finalizó o cuándo va a finalizar, sino que está en, como en progreso por un periodo largo de tiempo. The other, the third one. I am interviewing people for a new position. That's me, all right? Imagínense que yo estoy entrevistando a gente porque lo necesito para un puesto en el trabajo. When I find a person, I finish. Me debe yo contrate a la persona. Es como que vaya tú, ya no voy a seguir entrevistando a nadie más. I finish, all right? Something like that. Now, let's do something, all right? But before that one, is there any questions so far? Questions, questions. Is it clear? Piece of cake? Clear? <laughs> claro, como la horchata? <laughs> Something like that? Don't piece of cake. Don't uh, care. <laughs> okay, perfect. Let's do a quick exercise, all right? Let's jump to practice. Check on this one. Use your imagination, see? There is a friend you don't see for a long time. Esa expresión es bien común. Long time no see. Do you know the meaning of that one? ¿Saben qué significa esa expresión? Un largo tiempo. Tiempo de no verte. Ah, lo, lo entendemos como tiempo de no tiempo verte. verte. O tiempo sin verte, ¿ok? Es el tiempo sin verte, ¿ok? Imagine that one. You see a friend. Imagínese que usted ve a un amigo, ¿ok? A un, un amigo que no ve hace rato y se va a poner al día. Y se le dice, hey, hello. Una ex. Ah, no, tampoco. No, no, no. No, 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 no mister. No, come on. All right. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. All right. No it's problem. Possible. It, it's possible. <laughs> it's possible. You see a friend after a long, long, long time. And you talk to the person, hey, long time no see. If you're the other person, hey, what are you doing these days? Como usted se quiere poner al día. ¿Y qué estás haciendo? O sea, ¿qué ha pasado de nuevo? Podemos utilizar esa expresión. Por ejemplo, hey, I am going to the gym, right? No es que yo vaya a entrar eh, en, en tránsito para el gimnasio, pero estoy, no es un plan a futuro, pero es como, hey, fíjate que estoy yendo al gimnasio. Así lo entenderíamos. Algo que usted está haciendo. Hey, I am reading a book. I am learning English. Ah, really? O imagínese fuera la ex. I am dating someone. Estoy saliendo con alguien. <laughs> the right band. Le cae de balde de agua y ya estuvo. No more conversation. No, no more questions. Bye no bye. more questions. <laughs> no more questions. Bye bye. <laughs> All right. And then you can ask something like this. Hey, what about you? Right? Y para tirar la chivuela al otro. Y vos, what about you? Right? Let's do something quick. Hagamos un ejercicio así rápido. I am trying to forget you. I'm trying. <laughs> I am trying to forget. Hey, that's good. That's good, actually. Es, es, es muy válido. Estoy, estoy tratando de, de olvidarte. Hace rato inició, todavía está tratando, pero eventualmente esperamos que la supere. ¿verdad? I am trying to forget you. <laughs> Más ejemplos de la vida real no podemos dar, people. No more. <laughs> All right, something quick. Uh, I, I begin, right? Voy a iniciar rapidito. Hey, Brenda Ivette, long time no see. What are you doing these days? Um, make it up, make it up. Inventeselo, no problem. I'm, I'm studying. Ooh, all right, that's good. What are you studying? Um marketing and publicity all right thank you so much all right that's good so she's doing something temporary probably uh, she will finish in the future okay está estudiando no sabemos cuánto dura el curso pero no va a pasar estudiando toda su vida ¿verdad? entonces eventualmente ya va a finalizar i am studying that's the reference yeah. brenda choose this other year. person <laughs> uh, this year perfect 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 choose other person miss yvette Hacemos lo mismo, salúdelo. Long time no see. What are you doing these days? Please. Okay. Um, long time no see. 
what are you doing this day? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Lucy? Ah, perfect. Hello, Brenda. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm working. I am working. Uh -huh. I am studying. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Now, choose other person, please. Choose other person and go for the same. Let, give me a second. I show this to you. Oops, sorry. All right, go for the same. All right, choose other person. Hello, say hello. The name of the person and continue with the red lines, please. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, hello, long, hello, eh, <laughs> no me recuerdo de los nombres. I give you one, ya le doy uno, no se preocupe. Que vea más <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Hello, <laughs> Carlos, Carlos, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> hello, Carlos. Long time, no see, sí. uh -huh. what are you doing this day? Uh -huh. I, I, I study in uh, maintenance and in mechanic drones. Wow. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Can you say the information again, Mr. I? I, I study. I am a study. Ah, uh -huh. yeah. yes. uh, Maintenance. Maintenance, uh huh. Uh, drones. Uh, how do you spell that one? Yes. How do you spell that one? Maintenance. The uh, next one dr is drones. Drones. Ah, uh, drones. Ah, uh, right. Thank you. Yeah. All right. All right. That's interesting, Mister. Studying maintenance of drones. Oh. Amazing. Thank you so much, mister. Now, Carlos Antonio, choose the last person for the practice, please. Okay, teacher. Hello, uh, Nelson. How long time? No, see. Sí. No, see? Sí? Yeah. Sí no? what, are, what are you doing these days? What are you doing these days? Uh-huh. Okay. Nelson. Nelson. Next, next. No, no, sleeping. Nelson is ready. No, 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 Nelson is not <laughs> sleeping. No, no, no. <laughs> Nelson is dancing or no? No, no. He's no. <laughs> Go to the beach. <laughs> he's going to the beach. At this no. I guess he's. I guess he's driving. I guess he's driving. All right. He's in present continuous. He's driving. Choose other like, person, Carlos. Choose other okay. person. Please. Hello, hello, uh, Kenya. Long time not not see. What are you doing these days? These days. Thank you. Kenya, Kenya Patricia. Hello. <laughs> hello, hello. Uh -huh. Sorry. No problem. <laughs> What are you doing these days, Kenya? Um, I am going uh -huh. to my job. Mm -hmm. I am only that. All right, going <laughs> to my job. All right, something new, something new. Thank you so much. All right, people, nicely done for the ones who participated. Congratulations. For the rest, also, you did a nice job. But because of time, we are going to probably stop at this moment. And tomorrow, we have the chance to continue practicing. But tomorrow, in a, in a conversation, right? 
mañana vamos a tener práctica y vamos a poner pues más en contexto esta estructura. So, I expect you in the class. Bien, les espero en la clase porque vamos a tener un poco más de práctica y pues we continue learning a lot of information. So people, thank you so much for your time in the practice and are you ready to sleep? Yes. 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 No. Okay. No, okay. Watch TV, check the cell phone, watch TikToks, no problem, all right? But hey, it's possible, all right? But tomorrow we have the last class of the week. So people, have a good night and see you tomorrow. Take care. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night, good night, everybody. Take care.